where should I be investing in? Because technology is not the place to go into right now. So where should I be looking to invest is the question. Oh, by the way, just so you know, if you're ever wondering how powerful is this stuff, let me just show you guys this. Um, I say this because um, one of the one of the people that a lot of people talk about, and I have total, total respect for this person. So this is not in any kind of way, shape or form trying to bash the person at all. That's not what I'm doing here. I have huge admiration for this person that I'm going to be talking about now. And that's Kathy Woods. I believe she knows what she's doing. Very successful. Yes, she had a bad year, but come on. Who doesn't have a bad year when it comes to trading and investing or in any time of type of endeavor? Again, this is not me bashing her in any kind of way whatsoever. I have the utmost respect for Kathy Woods. But what I want to show you here is her fund, because I know a lot of people pay attention to her fund. Kathy Woods is somebody that a lot of people pay attention to and they follow in her funds and it's all oh, because her funds are doing horrible. The market is going to do horrible. No. I can show you that some of the stocks that Kathy Woods are in is in are not doing well. Companies like Zoom is not doing well. Companies like Peloton is not doing well. These are stocks that she is heavily invested in. Robin Hood, H O O D, you know, not doing well. And so she's heavily invested in a lot of these stocks that are just not doing well. And it's no wonder that her flagship fund is also not doing well. So for me, I would say that is not the gauge to pay attention to. So the next question a lot of people might be asking is, hey, because these stocks are beating down, should we start buying them? And my answer is not yet. Now, if you understand my market bottomless course and you understand that, fine, you can use that. I know a lot of people pay attention to her. I respect her a lot too. And, but I'm saying to myself until her flagship funds, I mean, a lot of the stocks that she has in there, unless those stocks try to turn around, she'll just have to wait it out is what she'll have to do. Does that make sense? Okay, so that being said, uh, what's next? Let me show you why I selected the sectors that I selected. 